Uh, many people say uh, a warrior in ancient times killed 29 uh, opponents. That's why they call it Vain Ten Webby, in com and, uh, commemorating the, the feat that he defeated 29 opponents with a folded knife. Bali means to break, and Song is the horn of the, uh, of the Carabao. So it means break the horn, or click, click, they call it. Sometimes it's referred to as the Batangas knife because it came from the Batangas province. Uh, when I was growing up in Stockton, California in the 40s, every kid, Filipino kid, can, knew how to use at least two or three motions on the bala song. And it was just natural. We're talking about openings. And it was just very natural, just like the kids play with tops and yo-yos. Every Filipino kid knew something about it. And then there was a time period where it sort of disappeared. But in the scream of systems, uh, it has always remained in the scream of system because uh, what you hold in your left hand usually is a dagger and you use it for disarming, and you use it for uh, slashing, you use it for thrusting. So uh, many people like, uh, like I said, in the screaming systems, prefer to teach it as a auxiliary weapon to the stick, or it could be used by itself. But learning it as a system in a functional way is another thing. So what we learned was the techniques when I got in the collie and the screamer. The opening, I, I sort of knew. See, because they used to tell us now, it's not the opening, it's when the knife is out, is how to use it. So it is taught as part of the double dagger system, and the single uh, dagger system, and the stick and dagger system, or the sword and dagger system. The bala song can be used close in this manner, as a hand weight, five sides, hitting this way, this way, this way, okay, this way, many efficient, it can be used in a reverse grip, such as this manner, okay. There are various different ways you can use it. It can be used open in the, what we call heaven position, or it can be used in earth position, okay? The techniques in my morality form, if you're empty hands, I don't think you have a right to, to use it in this manner, unless you're a life dependent upon it. But I prefer to use it as a, if a punch were to come out here, striking here and then hitting, and then going in here, and then you, maybe you can control with the knife out, according to morality, because I don't think you should stick a man if he has a, no weapon, but that's just more of my own uh, philosophy and uh, morality on that part, okay? I think it's addictive. Once you learn how to open it, it's very addictive. Uh, you, you tend to play with it. It's a thing you can play with uh, if you're a fidgety or whatever, and it's kind of flashy, and it's kind of challenging to learn different openings and things of that nature. It becomes uh, sort of like an acrobatic things or a gymnastic thing you can do with, with a knife. And uh, that's one aspect of the, of the Bala Song. Not only, not only as a fighting uh, weapon, but it can be used as a finger dexterity exercise type of thing. And people like that, and it's something you learn, and it's fun to play with, very addictive.